guys! Good day, everyone! Kayo po ay may mga karanasan sa buhay, sa pag-ibig, masaya man o masakit na nais yung i-share sa ating mga viewers. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Ang alaala ay ikaw. Malilimutan ko pa ba aking mahal? Ang maligayang araw nating nagdaan. Habang ako'y nag-iisang nalulumbay, ang alaala ay ikaw. Yes, my dear viewers, your story, Dr. Kon, will be sharing a real story today uh, coming from our letter sender. But before that, let me uh, shout out muna guys. At kung hindi pa ko, po kayo nakapag-like, share, and subscribe on my YouTube channel, please like, share, and subscribe na po. Uh, shout out po muna tayo sa aking 50 subscribers. Thank you so much for following me guys. At sa aking mga viewers, so much po. And of course, thumbs up tayo. At shout out tayo sa aking uh, uh, pinakamamahal na husband, si uh, Master Sergeant or Police Master Sergeant Jobert Poli. And uh, his company po na pinangunahan ng kanilang Chief of Police, si Police Major Christopher Candelario there in Pontevedra Police Station. And of course, to my children, uh, Maribeth, as my video taker always. And uh, to my uh, son, Josh Matthew and uh, Jam. And uh, of course, to Pontevedra National High School faculty and staff again, I am uh, uh, greeting you a uh, good day. At sa mga pinakamamahal kong mga sisters or mga madre dyan sa parochial school of St. Isidore, uh, kumusta kayo dyan, uh, Sister Jen, at sa mga kasamahan mo? And of course, the teaching staff, uh, I hope you are always safe. And uh, sa aking uh, mga kapatid dyan, si Mary Grace, si William, sa Kuwait, at sa kayong mga uh, siblings ko dito sa within the Philippines, Mary Ann, Gregorio, Boyet, at si Susan. Uh, sa mga sisters in loco po, si na Jocelyn, uh, si la Marisol, saka si Mary, or si Grace, no? at saka si la Mary Rose at uh, Maricar. Uh, guys, um, Thank you so much po for uh, viewing the post of Dr. Kon. It's a privilege for me po na kahit baguhan lang tayo ay uh, sinusundan nyo na po ang post natin. At saka sa mga nagko-comment dyan. So, thank you so much for that. Hala! Nawili na ako. Okay, so tara na guys. Uh, I hope that you are already excited to hear this uh, um, story. No? A story of our sender. Uh, and she wanted to be called only as Sampagita. Ang ganda ng pangalan, ano? Talagang napaka-sentimental, uh, no? Okay, so, uh, let us read now. Handa na ba kayo? Handa na rin ako, charot lang. Okay. Dear Dr. Con, Just call me Sampagita. Wow, ganda ng name. A 60 years old, a kapisenya, and married. At may isa pong anak, at sa ngayon ay may tatlo na pong cute-cute na mga apo. Dr. Con, uh, we are presently residing here in Manila for almost 20 years. I am uh, married to a retired police officer right now. And me is on the peak of preparing myself also five years from now in my uh, profession as teacher. So, I will be retiring, Dr. Con, for 5 years. Parang gusto ko nang mag-retire. For 63, no? Just like other viewers that you have, I wanted to share also my memories, especially on my married life. Yes, Dr. Con. You know, I am a kind of a person, or a kind of person, I should say, that uh, I could consider as aficionado or aficionada talaga or always valuing something especially those who are coming from my friends from my families or even from my husband i always keep something that has a sentimental value for me which is an opposite to my hobby dr corn kasi isa nga siyang pulis na you know there are full of abubot in our house, like letters, pictures, and many more. 
which sometimes my hubby and my daughter wanted me to throw it or itapo na lang daw o dili kaya sunugin na lang. But you know, Dr. Con, I really disagree with that idea because sabi ko nga, I am a sentimentalist person or as mahilig talaga ako mag-treasure ng mga bagay-bagay na nanggagaling sa isang uh, tao and I always uh, telling myself na yung mga bagay na naging part ng memories ko ay kailangan nasa sa akin din hanggang ngayon. Yes, Dr. Con. I remember Dr. Con 36 years ago when I met my husband which was uh, presently assigned during that time here in Capiz or there in Capiz. Uh, we have a, only a short period of time in knowing each other and he proposed marriage dahil nga siya noon ay my new assignment her and Manila. So modesty aside Dr. Con, I have a lot of sorters but I was struck on a man wearing uniforms. Yes, you're right. Nakaka-attract talaga sila, no? Kasi nga, pag naka-uniform, talagang, I want, di ko alam, no? So, at first, I was hesitant to say yes. And you know what? The only challenge na ibinigay ko sa kanya during that time is to marry me in a church which has a longest aisle here in the province of Capiz or there in a province of Capiz which one that could be considered as a historic church no? so I thought he will say no because yes Dr. Khan akala ko because of that challenge he will turn his back from me dahil aside from the fact na malayo ang place namin from that church Uh, since na nasa second district kami, I wanted also to be a June bride and of course, to have a bonga or grand wedding. And syempre, magastos, di ba? Okay. But, you know what? I really salute my husband because he is really a man of courage and has a word um, may nasasabi natin may isang uh, salita lang. Without any doubts, he said yes. From that moment, Dr. Con, um, our wedding was done there in Santa Monica Church, located in Panay, Capiz, which is the historical one. Ang sarap ng feeling during that time, Dr. Con, na nanaglalakad sa aisle na moment talaga dahil sulit na mairampa ang aking bonggang bridal gown plus the sound of the bell na halos feeling ko para talaga ako nasa ulap ay wow <laughs> ang sarap ano sa pagita sana all <laughs> anyway Dr. Con as of now uh, we really just treasure that memory na bubulol na naman ako we really treasure that memory that always gives us a sweeter smile every time na makikita namin yung pictures namin at every time na maalala ko na naging June bride ako during that time. And now, we are strongly bonded because my husband could be considered as a faithful one. Diba sabi nila, pag pulis daw ay matini. But I am very proud to say that my husband is a faithful one. And, uh, you know, Dr. Kwan, I am also very happy because we have a three, makukulit, and a cute-cute na ako. So, being an aficionada, I am still uh, keeping those pictures as in uh, additional to the abu bot in our house. And, you know, this time, I w we wanted to go home or to spend vacation there but because of this COVID-19 so we cannot do it anymore well Dr. Con, as a request po baka pwede nyong i-grant na inyong i-feature po ang historical church na ito 
so that for us to be updated if what is the the uh, latest feature of this uh, church even sa labas lang po and please kindly sing our um, love uh, or our theme song the one moment in time po Dr. Ton and uh, thank you so much more power to your uh, uh, program ang alaala ay ikaw and uh, I am very thankful if you can feature this story of mine although it is very short but I'm sure uh, it could really um, connect to those people who are just who are also like me na masyadong um, nag-iipon na mga kung ano-ano mga abubot na may sentimental value until here Dr. Kwan uh, thank you so much and uh, I will wait for the feature the church of uh, Santa Monica Parish Church your strolly Sampagita Okay, thank you so much, Sampagita, uh, for sending your, uh, or for sharing your story with us. Uh, alam mo, uh, katulad mo rin ako, napaka, napaka hilig mag-ipon ng mga abubot, especially yung mga binigay sa akin, ng mga kaibigan ko, or even yung mga pictures namin noon, mga, ng husband ko, o ng mga kaibigan ko noon na nagbibigay ng mga bags or wallets, kahit sira-sira na yun talagang iniipon ko. And you know what, my dear Sampagita, I am also uh, thankful na na-share mo ang story mo dahil nakaka-relate po ako sa'yo. Your strolly is also married to a police officer which I consider also as a faithful uh, husband and a very responsible one. So, alam nyo, or alam mo sa pagita and your hobby, uh, yung pagiging uh, sentimental uh, natin is part, part talaga yan ng ating pagkatao. Uh, especially, na lumaki tayo sa isang probinsya. There is no, uh, there is no bad uh, uh, impression there. Kasi, uh, di ba, yung mga memories will not, will not uh, go back again that will remain memories in the future so di ba noon nung hindi pa nagkaka-covid sabi natin ano na bang nangyayari sa sa daigdig tapos yung mga ginagawa natin noon na parang ayaw natin sabi natin ayaw na natin gawin especially yung mga halimbawa sa pagtuturo natin me as an example no uh, i uh, went to that period na sabi ko ay nakakapagod na mag-serve as a uh, sports official whatsoever but then at uh, this uh, time right now, all those things that happen in the past will serve as the memory na pwede nating babalik-balikan. So, walang masama, my dear Sampagueta. Sampagueta talaga, Charna. Wala pong masama sa iyong uh, attitude na nag-iipon ka ng mga abubot. Kasi, one way to remember sa mga bagay-bagay na nangyayari in the past. And you know, uh, I wanted to feature talaga ng Santa Monica Parish Church. Kaya lang, this time, with this COVID-19, we are following the uh, safety protocol. But as much as possible, I will go there. At kahit sa labas lang, ay magpipicture talaga tayo para sa iyong latest update. Update? Ano ba? Nampubulo na talaga si Dr. Kahn. Para sa latest update mo, kung ano na yung uh, hitsura ng Santa Monica Parish Church right now. So, that's all. And this time, uh, aawitin ko yung request mo. But, pero my dear Sampagita, wala lang po tayong background kasi uh, baka makaka-copyright claim na naman tayo ni uh, YouTube. So, ang gagawin na lang ni Dr. Kon is to sing na lang po na acapella kung okay lang sa'yo. Okay? So, para sa iyo ito, uh, my dear Sampagita, one moment in time. This is for you, Sampagita, and your hobby. Keep safe always, and uh, God bless po as sa iyong mga uh, apo at sa iyong anak. Para sa inyo ito, wala lang po tayong minus one para hindi tayo makapiraik kayo ni YouTube. It's the day I live, I want to be a day to give the best of me. I'm only one, but not alone. My finest day is yet unknown. 
I broke my heart for every game to taste the sweet. I face the pain, I rise and fall, yet through it all, this much remains. I want one moment in time, when I'm more than I thought I could be, when all of my dreams are hard be the way. And the answers are all up to me. Give me one moment in time when I'm racing with destiny. Then, in that one moment of time, I will be, I will be. My dear Sampagita, that is for you and your hobby. Stay safe for always. And I'm a um, uh, prayer for the long, long years of your hobby and your, and of course you, no? To be together. And uh, I hope na you will like the feature story of yours right now. And for the next po, we will be having our part two featuring the Santa Monica Parish Church in Panay Capiz. At sa mga viewers ko dyan na hindi pa po nagla-like, nag-share at na-subscribe. Please like, share, and subscribe na po kay your story, Dr. Con. Thank you so much po for viewing me at sa aking mga subscribers po. Thank you so much. Punta po tayo sa ating part 2. Abangan po ninyo. Bye! God bless po. I love you all.